going on? Good morning. It's Friday, November 15th. Happy birthday to my cousin, D. Jabbar. It's his birthday. And I'm King Philippe. <laughs> I just want to let y'all in on what I do in the morning when I first wake up. So, I just put on clothes because normally I don't sleep with clothes on. I just put on clothes. I cut myself in my face while I'm working on that. And I'm listening to my motivation, my favorite motivational speaker, Les Brown. Hold on, y'all. <laughs> I had to write that down. That was good. Robert Elliott, who's the head of the cardiology department at the University of Nebraska, he suffered a massive heart attack. He was in the hospital for three months, and while there, he reflected on his life as of this near-death experience. Because his mother and father, both of them had no history of heart failure, both of them lived to be over 80, and he wrote something. In order to live a long life and be happy, he said, number one, rule number one, don't sweat the small stuff. And rule number two, it's all small stuff. <laughs> Isn't that real? <laughs> Les Brown is amazing. He is truly amazing. And I got to write that down. But um, every morning when I wake up, before I leave the house, head to work, or do anything, first thing I do is turn the TV on, go straight to YouTube, or pick up my phone and go straight to YouTube and type in Les Brown. I normally go for the shortest video. It's a 15-minute video. I think it's called Morning Motivation that I normally read every morning. I'm going to to every morning while I'm getting ready. But today, I don't have to be at work, so I'm getting ready to do a new pod show. So today, I decided to go for this 18-minute long um, video. And this one is called, look, let me put my glasses on. Oh, I can't see. This one is called, uh, What You Hold In Your Heart. We said we want to go for the small stuff. In order to live a. Hold on, I gotta get that. Why is my green pen? It's awesome, awesome. <laughs> See, not only is he motivational, he messy, <laughs> and he's funny, man. But he's not messy at all. Very inspiring. <laughs> See? Oh, yeah. I bought this book yesterday. I started reading it over in the night. And it's by Jewel Osteen. We got to Kanye West. They can really do an event together. Yes, this is dope. This is so dope. Brilliantly disguised. But yeah, you got the. Walk out into the world or to whenever with the positive, clear mind. You know, and listening to Les Brown every morning give me the strength and the vibes that I need. You know, the positive vibe and the, and the um, 
and the courage. He encouraged me to tackle these days and just stay motivated, stay in control. Not only um, does his um, videos and autos help me get my day started and help me through the day, but I have this affirmation chart. Not chart, but you know. I read these every morning. It's 20. I also got, because I'm, I'm not at home. I'm in Georgia. So at home, um, y'all probably seen them in the background or whatever in my studio, in my bedroom. I got them all over. But I just get up and I just. I get up every morning and. Before I get ready to leave out, I come back and I read it. Number one, when things go wrong, don't go with them. Number two, create what you want. Build your dreams from the bottom up. Number three, life is hard, so do it hard. Most of these I got from his um videos. But a lot of them, I have this affirmation um app on my phone that I look at daily. I also played a little Elevate game. Is it Elevate? I like that game. I like to challenge my mental. And, um, and I love knowledge. You know what I'm saying? I love knowledge. I'm trying to find one that I... That <laughs> See, I'm going to pause him. I'm about to come back to that. <laughs> he said, you can't get out of life alive. That is so true. See? I can see not being inspired. <laughs> it's true T. It's true T. Okay. I want to read y'all that I really, really like. Uh, this one that I really like, I have the freedom to do as I choose with my time. That's good. I give thanks and I choose to be happy. That's a big one for me. So I wore depression like my, like it was my favorite sports jacket or something. I finally threw that away. Um, I constantly have new purpose and I create great opportunities. My life is full of joy. I am profoundly thankful for my own unique and wonderful life. I had the courage to believe in my vision and to take the steps that are necessary towards it. Stuff like this every day in, the, in your mind, how could you not <laughs> change the way you think by listening to this and reading this every day and keeping it right there, like eventually and it's been like two months, so I'm really, really deeply in, in bed with this. Like, I feel like I'm falling in love again. <laughs> For the first time, real love, you know? With myself and my mind, my mental. It's amazing. It's amazing. Other than that, um, I may make a few phone calls. Not too many because, you know, people have their energies and, you know, they have life going on and you don't want them vibes and and that energy to trans transfer over to you. So when I clean out my, my, my energy, I like to keep it clean throughout the whole entire day unless I just absolutely can't help it. And then when I get into a situation to where I feel like my energy or my... Um, 
atmosphere was tampered with with neg- negativity I'll um, I'll go away mentally if I can't physically get away like if I'm at work or something but if I'm at work I try to step off to the bathroom or something say a quick prayer Usa, and just bring myself right back you know cause life is too short for the BS I feel now moving on um I'm about to start working on this podcast I got like five podcasts I need to do I also did a um YouTube um re- reaction review to Janae new video uh, I got a new single dropping on the 22nd, and what else, what else, what else, what else, oh yeah, Royal Moon is the project, as of right now, we got 17 tracks, absolutely, so, I've been up, late into the wee hours of the night trying to position each song and where I want it to come on the track and oh my god y'all know that it's so fun also I'm doing the mix the mix and mastering on majority of the songs maybe every song except like three two or three and those are like two or three songs that I took from when I back in Montgomery that was never on a project so I'm gonna put those songs on that record. But other than that all the other ones are completely missed mixed and mastered by me. <laughs> oh boy. Now I gotta get up and brush my teeth. My teeth are still nice though. Hmm. That was just too much. And I do the pod show. What else? What else? What else? I'm gonna read some more. May may go shopping. I need something to go to the club tonight. <laughs> that don't even sound right. <laughs> Honestly, y'all, I haven't been to the club since. Blue, my brother Blue, birthday. That was in the summertime, I know. It was either before my surgery or after my surgery, I can't quite remember. And before then, the only time I had been to the club this year was my birthday. No, I did not go out for my birthday. I did not go to a club. So it was New Year. So this is going to be my third time going to a club this year. If I go... So rainy in Georgia. I'm gonna play y'all my new record before I let y'all get away. Oh boy. I'm still kind of sleepy though. Down, I kept it real for you. My home, your home, my home, that shit. 
Forget you, but you in there, you say you're leaving, I don't believe the touch you. You better be ready to take both me out. For years I gave you uh, I'll be damned if I let it go Or I'll be collecting bodies At your door <laughs> Right where the music dropped In 20 seconds You've been doing me wrong Go away 